Is that Snoop? I did not know that Snoop was in this. That's totally him, is it not? Welcome back to my channel, it's Brandy, and we are throwing it back to a song from my childhood today, and I am actually really excited to check this video out, because I know the song, I'm very familiar with the song, but I never actually watched the video for it, and I've been seeing it resurfacing, and I recently actually just watched, there was a documentary on Netflix about the 1999 Woodstock that went on that was like an absolute freaking train wreck. Little side note, go watch it if you have it on Netflix. It's actually really, really cool. And I never knew about it. I mean, in 1999, I would have been six years old. So I wasn't watching the news then. But I do now. So I'm informed. And it was crazy. But anyways, long story short, it made me think about Limp Bizkit, which is what brought us to today's video. But before we get into everything, fellow reminder, I do put up new videos here every single day at 4 p.m. Eastern. So if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. And I stream over on Twitch Monday through Thursday at 9 p.m. If you want to come through for the late night vibes, that is the place to do it. We can chill, we can chat, and we can kind of discuss what's going on here or what games I'm playing over there. But without further ado, we're going to get into today's video, which is the iconic song from Limp Bizkit break stuff here we go it's just one of those days where you don't want to wake up everything is everybody sucks you don't really know why but you want to justify and someone's head off no human contact and if what's with the editing your life is on contract your best bet is to stay away mother it's just one of those days it's all about the he says she says fools is that snoop I did not know that Snoop was in this. That's totally him, is it not? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, this feels so 90s coded. It's just one of those days, feeling like a freight train. First one to the plane, leaves with the blood stain. Dude, what is with the celebrity cameos in this song? Another one! We got M? Oh my god! I, I so apologize for pausing here. I'm going to go back. They can say ass raw, but they can't say bullshit. I'm sorry. <laughs> make it make sense, internet. Make it make sense. Mic drop. Dude, the amount of cameos in this video. Like, first off, this is so 90s coded and I love it. But secondly, seeing this, 
It just makes me think more if any of you guys saw that uh, Netflix documentary or just know about what happened at the 1999 Woodstock. They played this song and the crowd was already super rowdy. And as a result, not as a result of this song, but the crowd started breaking stuff and like tearing down parts of the stage and things like that. And, like, all of the people who had produced the whole thing were like, oh, my God, why would they do such a thing? And it's like, dude, look at the lineup of bands that you had. You were already having these people pissed off at you for, you know, X, Y, and Z things. And then you bring out bands like this who are literally like, if you have aggression, if you're angry at, you know, the man or, your, or whatever, break shit, do stuff, like, retaliate. How did they not expect chaos to ensue obviously not to the extent but like come on listen to this this makes me not necessarily breaks up but this makes me want to get up and dance and like throw punches maybe not at people because i'm i'm not a fighter okay <laughs> but like ah, you just i have, feel like i have so much energy just from listening to this from watching them from absorbing the energy that is coming off of this video there's a reason that this song is so iconic and still lives on you know 20 something years later almost 30 oh my gosh that this song is still so iconic i want to know your thoughts i'm assuming i i this might be a, a big assumption but i'm gonna make the assumption that literally everybody watching this video has heard this song before or if you are someone like me or who grew up in the 90s this is your childhood here i remember listening to this song probably shouldn't have been listening to it but i remember listening to this when i would be like in my room with my sister playing you know playstation after school and doing like crash team racing and spyro and like tony hawk pro skater like this is what this music makes me think of and i love it i love it so i, I would like to know your thoughts and um if you are also a kid of the 90s when you hear this music, what does it bring you back to? Tell me, I want to know your nostalgia moments that you're having, that I'm having while I also listen to this. Share those with me. I would love to hear it. But that is going to be it for me for today. If you like those, please give it a big thumbs up. And hopefully I get to see you in the next video. So until then, bye!